we got plenty of cows out there today, which is good. And I gotta be grazing much longer for this year, and then it'll be back to hay and grain. Wow. Good morning, everybody. How are you today? It's Brian from Landscaping Maine, as you know, because you already tuned into the channel. So, don't know again what's going to happen today. We will film as we go and figure it out. <laughs> hey, I'm back here. I'm out on my walk, and I ran into uh, three <laughs> lovely ladies. They are from uh, where are you from? North Dakota. North Dakota. What part? Wilson. And hence, that's why the sign is behind them. Uh, just first names is great. Start over here on the left. First name? Carol. Carol. Lynette. Lynette. Karen. Karen. All right. So I'm wondering, how did you guys come to Wilton, Maine? Where drew you here? We are from Wilton, North Dakota, and we came on a sister trip to the New England states, and we're touring around, and we wanted to stop here in particular. That's I awesome. Did. I still live there. You still live there. Okay, so... All right, who does most of the driving? He does. <laughs> I do everything. So where are you going next? We are going to Grantham, Grantham, Grantham New Hampshire. Grantham, New Hampshire. Yes, very nice. Airbnb. All right, well, don't forget, make sure you hit the notches while you're up there. They're beautiful. The notches? The notches, like um, Evans Notch. That's a beautiful one. And uh, what's the other one? Can't think of it right now. Oh, Dixville Notch. Beautiful. There's the man in the mountain over there too, right in that same area. So we're going to the White Mountain. Alright, yep, you gotta be right in the right area. Alright, I won't keep you guys. I know that you guys left your car running, but thank you. Really appreciate it. Be careful on your ride back home. So when you are you guys on your way back now or are you guys? We're going to Boston. You're going to Boston? Connecticut. We're going to go home until the first week of our week. On the first week of a two week trip, okay. Well, I'm originally from Massachusetts. If you get down there, you gotta go to Sturbridge, check out Old Sturbridge Village, it's great. That's what you need to know. Yeah. It's great stuff. So, welcome to the home of the Blueberry Festival. Yeah. All right, guys, have a safe trip. Thank you. Uh, that was really nice of them. I hope they have a great trip and have a lot of fun while they're along there. We're doing it. So, uh, that was a pleasant surprise. So, I'm gonna continue my walk, go back to the house and see what's going on. Well, I don't know if the footage came out of the deer that was watching me and then ran across the street, or road, as we say here. So, I hope it did. I'm going to crop it. The footage may not be real good at that point, but I'm going to crop it, see what it looks like, and uh, hopefully we get that deer. So, one of the perks to moving here was there's a couple apple trees out back, and this one is doing pretty good. We don't spray or anything, so... Oh, look. We found Brent yet again. What are you doing today, Brent? Picking apples. Picking apples. Try not to fall off the line. So these apples behind me are Wyman apples. Uh, they came over here from Europe before the Revolutionary War. And they were rebooted in Kansas in 1827 by Joseph Wyman, hence the name. And later on they were found growing in Virginia so that they tend to like more of a humid area so I'm not really sure why they're in the backyard but I'm really glad they are because they're really good they're very tart if you like tart this is the apples for you yep I mean you're gonna know, fill the basket aren't you that's what I'm gonna do for the I figured I could reach enough what you got there bro Basket of apples. Basket of apples. Mm -hmm. Alright. You gonna eat all those? Eventually, yeah. yeah. Can I make some apple sauce? Uh, not out of this batch, but probably the next one. The next batch? Look how proud he is. He's like we're on a field trip. They got nice size this year. They do. They're quite big. Well, since it is a nice autumn day here, basically. Uh, gonna wash the cars one more time, so go get the fresh washer out and have some fun with the water. Maybe I'll squirt right. <laughs> you 
So in the process of washing the uh, the in the process of washing the pressure washer, um, wouldn't stay running. Got me to tweak on that a little bit, and the little blue end that puts the soap on in, in the wax, that kind of that kind of went poof. So I'm gonna see if I can find it. I found a deer, and I found people from North Dakota today. Maybe my luck will hold up, and I'll be able to find this too. Hey, guess what? I didn't find the tip to the pressure washer. <laughs> I kind of saw that coming, and that's okay. I get the pressure washer running better. Uh, it doesn't stay running, so gotta do that. And the good news is that the tips are cheap. I'll give it another look around tomorrow. It could have gone anywhere though. So, anyways, today's video is short sweet to the point and not a lot to talk about or happened today but that's okay we all have those days so i'm gonna call this a nice refreshing day so don't forget to like subscribe and hit the little bell icon so that you get notifications of every video that landscaping me posts thank you so much i appreciate that have a great one peace out